Yo, what's going on, guys? Your boy Pony Montana, and in this video, we are going over a quick money play that you need to be using if you are struggling to run the ball in Madden 24. Now, before I get into it, if you guys are new to the channel, do not forget to hit that subscribe button, like the video, and comment down below. This is a quick tip video on the best run play in Madden that you guys need to be using. And the run play that we're going to be talking about today is Stretch Alert Lucky coming out of these playbooks specifically. Uh, wait, 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 wait. So I could... It, there we go. These playbooks specifically, the Bills, Bengals, blah, 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 blah. Take a screenshot if you are looking for it in your playbook. And the play is Stretch Alert Lucky. This is an RPO play, um, and you can pretty much run this against every single every single defense in the game. Uh, it's an RPO, which means that the defense does not adjust to it like they should against certain runs. So against this against this RPO, they have to completely sell out all on the strong side of the field because if you notice. We have nothing but numbers on this side of the ball. Now, I did talk about this in the Jets ebook video that I made, but obviously this is in more than just the Jets playbook. But if you guys want to move the ball a little bit more consistently and better, it, this is definitely a play that I would, you know, convince you guys to use because it's it's just so easy to use. The best part about it is they start adjusting too much and they start like trying to run commit. Then you have the option to throw the actual passing option of that and if they completely start to sell out and run it to that side you can go ahead and and, and run a dive play that's going to be able that you're, you're going to be able to take it to the outside or if i call timeout or uh uh the timeout button for this specifically you can actually add a play that you can take it straight to the left side with this halfback inside zone so so now you have both options you have the literal best run play in the game and if you see that they start committing so too many people to that right side or left side depending on which side that you're running it then you can flip it oh let me just get a nice little run here then you can flip it and run the halfback inside zone to the left side it makes your life 10 times easier um and again it, when you're when you're looking for a good run game again this is on all madden this is not on all pro or any of that or any of that stuff and you can tell simply by simply by me showing you guys the play art there is no indicator on which is the strong side for you guys to run it better on uh, but yeah, this is literally the best run play in the game. So if you guys are looking to and you know kind of end the game and run clock out and do all that stuff, make sure you guys are utilizing this play. Now there aren't really two crazy passing plays out of this formation, but again, you honestly won't even need it with these with these plays being in in the playbook. So again, even the halfback dive, it's a it's another RPO, which means that you're going to be able to sit there and confuse the defense as much as possible. This is the best run play in Madden 24. Make sure you guys are using it. Make sure you guys are adding it to your scheme, to your custom playbooks, whatever the case is, and start dominating that run game. My name is Pony Montana. I'll see you guys in the next video, man. As always, two fingers, deuces, and peace out, you guys.